In the late 20th century, an inventor named Stanley Meyer captured the imagination of the world with a revolutionary idea, a car that could run on water. Meyer claimed to have developed a technology that could split water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen through a process called electrolysis, allowing a vehicle to operate using nothing but water. In 1989, Meyer showcased his water-powered car, demonstrating its remarkable efficiency. He claimed that his vehicle could travel over 100 miles on just a few ounces of water, an astonishing feat that could reshape the automotive industry and reduce our dependence on fossil fuels. Meyer's invention garnered significant media attention and drew interest from investors and even government officials. However, as excitement grew, so did the scrutiny. Despite this, Meyer stood firm, asserting that his invention worked. In March 1998, during a meeting with Belgian investors, Meyer suddenly fell ill. He rushed out of the restaurant, proclaiming to his brother, they poisoned me. Tragically, he collapsed in the street and shortly after was pronounced dead from what officials later attributed to a brain aneurysm. Meyer's untimely death sparked a wave of conspiracy theories. Many believed that he was silenced to suppress his groundbreaking technology, which posed a threat to the oil industry. Despite the evidence of his work, the water-powered car faded into obscurity, leaving behind a trail of unanswered questions.